tight. First one, two times hard. <clears throat> I feel the anesthesia take hold as I lie on the surgical table. Just before I pass out, I hear the doctor say, move them to the penis explosion chamber. I was getting thirsty, so I had a sip of soda. It was too late when I realized it was scary soda. Oh no, it's Jeff the Killer. I'm going to Jeff the Kill you. I hate tomatoes, I said to myself. Peering out the bus window, I realized we were approaching the tomato factory. Help me, what? They make them. My excitement turned to horror as I opened my birthday gift. Inside was a one-way ticket to Slenderman. What does this even mean? Scary. <laughs> the fucking emoji man. <laughs> one time, I was hungry late at night and I opened my pantry. No cereal. Sad face. Yeah, you know, I think having no food is pretty scary myself. It almost feels like Christmas, except I've got no eggnog. Thankfully, I can just milk some more for my creature. The family enjoys their milk at the table. Little do they know it was harvested for my creature. I ran out of ketchup, so I went down to the basement. The creature whimpered. He knows it's time for another milk. He knows it's time for another milking session. Hey, chef, I called into the kitchen. My meal began being prepared by a creature. <laughs> my girlfriend wiped the tears from my eyes with a tissue. Little did she know the tears came from the creature I have in the basement. As I fell on my bed, I wanted to cry and seek help. Faithfully, my creature has a PhD in psychology. He kept complaining about the food at the Five Star restaurant, but it tasted great to me. I guess the stomach rats agreed. <laughs> what the fuck is this like fascination with the creature? And it's not just like specified, they just call it the creature. Like we're supposed to know right off the bat, like, yeah, you know, it's a creature, right? Like what the fuck? Right, one more. And I swear it's another, if it's another creature one. Ah, finally, I'm all alone, I said to myself as I sat in my bedroom at midnight. No, you're not, said Knife Guy. I was playing with my boobs. No, you're not, said Knife Guy. Then a brick fell on my cock. <laughs> what? So we have the return of fucking Knife Guy with the same misspelling. What the fuck? Wakes up with a new vagina. Well, dog. Those new COVID vaccines really have some wild side effects. I don't know how to respond to that. We're just to the next one. Before being reincarnated, I asked God to make sure I was born a boy because I never want to risk FGM. Now I'm two days old. I'm shut down on a cold board and a man is moving towards my genitals with a scalpel because my parents are religious. I want my foreskin back. <laughs> no foreskin guy. That's fucking wild. Okay. The puppy was hungry, but there were no more tasty life forms left in this multiverse. This place has 31 flavors. Gulp. This place has 30 flavors. I don't know why, but when I read this wine, it reminds me like those like uh, memes are like me walking out of fucking five guys with all the peanuts stuffed up my ass. I have no idea why, but that's what I think about when I read this. It's a really weird connection, and therefore I'm moving on. I wasn't worried when the terrorist warlord gave his orders to burn me alive because I was a soldier and I would never betray my country. This is what I thought until I tried to kill myself with a cyanide pill before I could be tortured, only to find out that a cool mint flavored Tic Tac was excellently placed in my pill case. I was attempting to pose on two sentences to horror. They banned me. That might be real. Anyways, uh, this was a quick video. I don't know what the fuck this was. I might do more. Anyways, uh, like, subscribe. I'll, I'll catch y'all later. Uh, yeah, uh, goodbye.